نام ما قدری است ما از افغانستان هستم I've been living in this country over 12 years and I'm doing this English GCC course because I want to go um, into teaching. My native language is uh, Persian. There are uh, quite differences between the two languages, the English and the Persian. In English, you write from left to right, where in Persian, we write from right to left. Alphabet is completely different. Persian is very phonetic, easy. There is a relationship between the sounds and the spelling, where I found it a little bit hard in English. The word order in Persian is, uh, is different to English. We always put uh, verbs at the end. For example, if I say a beautiful girl, Like in my language, you say the girl first and then the beautiful. When I learned English at the beginning, it was quite challenging and hard for me. I was changing all the words from my language to English, but it didn't make sense. In my language, um, we don't have pronouns for um, he, she, they. We only have for it, which applies to everyone. We don't have uh, articles in Persian. For example, uh, an apple, a TV. I didn't use the articles at the beginning in my essays and in my writing. I think uh, my weaker point is um, the grammar, the writing. Still I'm struggling and still I'm learning. The past participle and the perfect tense were quite challenging where we don't have in our language. Uh, I really enjoy learning English and uh, since I began the course, I can see a lot of improvement. When the teacher here yeah, gave me my work back, I checked the feedback and um, correct my mistake and uh, it really improves my English and I know where my weakness point is. I would like to have a grammar uh, English book are a useful websites so I can improve my articles, prepositions and advanced grammar. I like uh, learning the language. I do enjoy it.